Okay, so we're now joined by uh, the boss lady of Urban Dance Academy, Danny. Hi, Danny. Welcome to BDO. Oh, thank you. So this is not your first time at the rodeo. Why do you keep coming back? So we've been at BDO now um, for about two years, and we've come back because you know BDO is so established, and we know that we're going to get good results, and the judges are great, and the event is super organised, and we always just have a great time. This is our first time in Telford, the International uh, Centre in Telford. Yes. It's, it's such a lovely venue and there's loads around here. Yes. And actually in this room, describe the atmosphere. Honestly, I can't even explain to you, it has been insane. As soon as you walk in, straight away you feel it. And everybody was just so excited both days, which is what you want. And it's just been the most amazing experience for everyone. Now, you know more than anybody else, that there is so much work that goes into these competitions, you know, and that's not just putting it on, the, the schools themselves have a lot of work to do. Yeah, yeah. And it's a seven day a week job. Why do you do it? <laughs> Honestly, I, I can't get my words up because yeah. it is so, it's really heartwarming, you know, and I do it because I know I've trained as a dancer, I've gone to college as a dancer, you know, we get paid to teach these kids, but actually it is more than that. You know, like it's a family, in confidence, making friends for life, you know, you get more out of that than you do anything else and I always say to my children, you make my heart smile and it might sound a bit corny no, it but no. it's, you know, it's just everything. Yeah. And you were telling me before how lovely it is on weekends like this to see your family coming together. Yeah, yeah. Um, what's it like when you win? Because I can imagine it just, it must just go off. So yesterday we had a double win. What? So we had uh, Radical, our junior crew, they won a 12 and under first timer, so they're world champions. And then we had Elaboration 16 and under win. Uh, our first crew descendants there, uh, 8 and under, they came forth but they've only been together 6 months. And then we just had a triple win, we just had first, second and third in 6 and under first timer. So, oh my goodness. That's like, one huge party at your yeah. camp, right? We are going to have the biggest party. Tuesday is training, pre-training. I don't think we're going to get much training in. No. It'll be a little bit of a party. What, so hold on, you go straight back into training on Tuesday? Straight back into training. No messing. I mean, that's pretty tough. Do not just have a day off? Never. <laughs> um, actually, we've got a day off on New Year's Eve <laughs> and uh, Christmas Eve. So and then we're straight back in. But there, but there you go, then that's that's how you do it. Don't give the kids any time off. Get them in the studio every single day, but they can they can have a day off when Santa comes. Alright then. Yeah. I'll let them have that. That's their present. If you had to sum up this weekend here at BDO in, in one sentence, what would it be? Do you know what? There's so many words that I could use. Um, but I just think it's, you know, taking away the friends for life. And even just making friends from other teams, that's what we do. And that is what that is what more people should do. Um, and it's just the team spirit and you know, it's just amazing. Honestly, thank you BDO because you've brought so much to our team and our school. That was longer than one sentence, but I've got to cry because it was so, so lovely. <laughs> I cried yesterday twice. Did you? And my, my best friend was here and um, she said you're quite a hard face and quite a hard person exterior. And yeah, I, I cried twice and she was like, wow. That, is that exhaustion? That's how, <laughs> that's how much it meant to me, but yeah, yeah it was exhausting yes. as well. Yeah. And I needed a wine. Yeah. <laughs>